<clears throat> Aita Shalawam, uh, first and foremost, I want to give our all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwadash. And I'd like to give our double honors unto the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone. And uh, much blessing to you, brothers out there, laboring in truth and in sincerity. Okay. Um, this is uh, on our, was on Russia today, our teen news, on, uh, published on uh, 6 January 2019. And uh, basically, uh, in German, they did uh, they did a poll. It says uh, to did, they did a poll in uh, among the people to see uh, uh, what nation the people are pretty much uh, saw as a threat or what nation the people feared the most. Man, as a uh, in uh, in terms of being a threat to them. And uh, you know, because you know, as always, Russia always tops that list okay because uh russia have their own way of doing things man okay but not far from it man okay the, uh the nation's biggest ally the u.s it says uh russia tops list of germans gem uh germany's biggest fear fears but u.s is only one point behind okay so again the u.s has gained has is, is topping that list of uh being uh uh a nation that uh, the, uh, people are looking at thinking man the th uh if there's a threat to the world man it has to be this nation man okay and uh the u.s because the u.s like to portray themselves as being the protectors of um the protectors or the uh the world police but now the nations are looking at the different countries are looking at the u.s as being uh as been an actual threat to the world man okay uh it says uh, Russia tops list of Germans' biggest fears, but the U but U.S. is only one point behind. The U the U.S. Germany's closest uh, German the U.S. Germany's closest strategic ally came surprisingly close to the boogeyman Russia in the list of countries that the Gem uh, the Germans fear the most, leaving North Korea and other lag and other lag behind. A new poll revealed me so. It's not even uh, Iran or uh, North uh, North Korea that the people are fearing. Man, they're looking at the America now as you know, man. If there's a threat to the world, man, it's not all these countries, man, that uh, that keep coming up in the news, man. It has to be the U.S., man. Okay, so the people are looking at the U.S. differently now, man. Okay, so increasingly, as many as 55% of Germans believe the U.S. is almost an equal threat to their country as Russia which scored 56 which scored 56 percent in the latest study of our fossa poster uh build reports other countries that uh, that usually dominate mainstream airwaves trail far behind okay so so you can imagine now it's, it's like the this, this situation of north korea man everything that we kept on hearing on the news about north korea uh the missile testing and uh everything that you keep seeing on the news about iran and uh their threat to the new uh their secret uh, mis uh building of secret nuclear missiles and so on but the people man they're not they're not even looking at those nations anymore man they're looking at uh the actual powerhouse itself america which is supposed to be an ally to the uh to the european nations I'm gonna get over there in a second, cause remember what uh Macron had said. Uh, let me see if I let's see. Uh, let's say uh, for instance, only 27% of Germans feel threatened by North Co by North Korea. I mean that's more than double uh the percent compared to uh that's around double the percent compared to uh, uh America, man. Okay, so that's less than that's less than half the percent. Let me say that that's less than half the percent that's around half the percent uh of germans feel threatened by north korea compared to america which until recently was the main source of nuclear weapons related news I mean, and we kept on seeing a lot of that every time in the news north korea this and north korea that okay it says uh the uh the reclusive state that followed by turkey 24 percent and saudi arabia 23 percent china is deemed a threat to only 60 percent of uh respondents says the u.s germany's long-standing nato ally and main trading partner okay so you the u.s is supposed to be uh in partnership with germany okay they're supposed to be good friends buddies buddies okay mainly intimidates people of middle age 
while the poor German saying Russia was a danger to international peace in included the younger respondents aged 18 to 29 as well as those in their 60s. The poll provided an interesting outline of respondents' political sympathies, right-wing voters with anti-immigrant alternative for Germany partner being the sole exception, tend to favor Washington and fear Moscow while supporters of the left parties express opposite views. So again, America is now becoming up, is becoming less and more and more isolated on the on the uh on in the world, man, with um with their allies, man. Okay, because now they they they're coming up and saying now the the threat to the world is uh is America, man. Okay, remember what Macron said at the, uh I believe it's in the middle of last year. I've got the article here when uh Emmanuel Macron said that um uh, the uh the uh Europe need to create um an army. To defend against uh, America, I mean, Emmanuel Macron calls for a real European army to defend against Russia and the U and U.S. Because remember what uh, the uh, NATO was created for. NATO was created by the European Union, including uh, including America, to defend against Russia. Okay, but now saying Russian leaders are come, saying um, uh, European leaders are coming up now and saying we need to uh, we need to create we need to create uh their own army men okay an, an army that's outside away from the u.s from the u.s influence okay to defend against russia and if and and the u.s itself man okay so america again is is, is being isolated man okay at these times now we're on the decline of america man okay we're living in the times where but we're gonna see uh the judgment come on america man where the lord is gonna completely destroy it man okay so the french pres president says Europe needs to be able to defend itself better alone without depending on the United States, okay, because they want to defend themselves against America itself, man, okay, which that's all in the scriptures. It says a real European army is needed to defend itself against Russia and even the United States, Emmanuel Macron has said, man, because the world, for a long time in Russia, if you even watch the, movie, the, uh, the different movies that they would make, it was always Russia being the big bad wolf, okay, but now people are the dishes are turning around and said, "Look, man, look at what America is doing, man. Okay, look at all the uh, the, the the chaos that they are causing, man. The uh, uh, the destruction that they're bringing to the world, man. Okay, uh, it says the French president has pushed for a joint European Union Union military force since his arrival in power. Defense ministers from nine European countries will meet in Paris." For the first time on Wednesday to de to to begin discussion on how such a force would operate, man, and best believe me, they're they're already talking about it right now, okay? Because they haven't they haven't really mentioned too much about it afterwards, but they already got plans. They already got plans for it, man. Okay, it says we have to protect ourselves with respect to China, Russia, and even the United States of America, Mr. Macron told radio station Europe One. Mr. Macron, who was elected as president in May 2017, said Europe needed to be less reliant on America. He remarks, he remarks where his his remarks were partially fueled by U.S. President Donald Trump's decision to pull out of a Cold War era nuclear treatment, which was which was a big deal to the to the whole planet, man. Okay, because now it allowed outside of that treaty, it allowed everybody now who was who was bound. to uh, to this treaty who 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 were not supposed to make uh, particular missiles uh now because the treaty um, Donald Trump was pulled out of that treaty now they were able to create those uh those uh, uh the, those are uh, uh particular missiles that were uh, that were forbidden in the treaty man and that was the danger to the planet f okay now let's go to another one uh this is an, a slightly older article it says world World's confidence in U.S. leadership under Trump at new low. Paul finds man. Okay. He says that uh, global confidence in U.S. leadership has fallen to a new low, and the country now ranks below China in world worldwide in world in worldwide approval ratings, according to a new uh, Gallup poll. The survey of opinions in 134 countries showed a record collapse in approval for the. For the U.S. role in the world, from 48 percent under Obama to 30 percent after one year of Donald Trump, the lowest level Gallup has recorded since the beginning 
of its global leadership poor over a decade ago man so even the world now man they're looking at uh they uh their confidence in america i mean is is uh is is uh is a uh, deteriorating man okay it's uh it's, it's vanishing away okay now um let me see okay i'm not gonna read all these articles the full but i'm gonna let me go to uh obadiah i'll read um i'll read uh, obadiah one and one and i jump down to the to the uh the seventh verse this obadiah one and one it says the vision of obadiah that saith yahweh power concerning edom okay we have heard a rumor from yahweh and an ambassador is sent among the heathen arise ye and let us rise up against her in battle okay says behold i have made thee small among the heathen thou art greatly despised now let's look up that word small okay if you look up that word small uh uh kata katan kata if i'm reading it correctly it says uh to be young small insignificant and it and important okay small insignificant okay so now the different nations now so america america is being looked being looked at now as as insignificant okay they look at america now like you know you know your opinion does not really matter anymore okay they do not have as much influence as they did before man okay let's look at uh, insignificant on google search It says insignificant this is from the google search insignificant it says uh too small or unimportant to be worth consideration uh okay too small or unimportant to be worth consideration man can you see from how, how america how high america has come from okay from being whatever america says that that goes from now that being considered as too small or unimportant to be to be worth considering man okay says behold i have made thee small among the heathen thou art greatly despised man and can you see slowly but surely man just a few articles that are brought up and that shows you how america has been made insignificant and uh, that confidence is now conf uh, the word confidence towards america has been is dropped and uh, uh uh nations want to create armies now uh look uh let me go to this what did mark one say uh where is that uh where's that bit that i read yeah this could say the uh the french president says europe needs to be able to defend itself better alone without depending on the united states man okay so um, uh, the lord is taking away that power that america has and that influence that america has on these different nations man okay uh let's jump down to number seven okay i'll start from six is how are the things of esau searched out how are his hidden how how are his hidden things sought out this obadiah one and six by the way says uh verse seven it says all the men of thy confederacy have 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 brought thee even to the to the border the men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee now let's look up the word confid uh, confederacy okay okay uh confederacy bara barath barayath okay it says uh covenant alliance pledge okay between men treaty alliance league man to man constitu constitu constituency constitution ordinancy monarch to subjects agreement pledge alliance of friendship alliance of marriage between god and man alliance of friendship covenant okay divine ordinancy with signs and pledges okay covenant covenant making covenant uh keeping covenant violation 
violation okay so they they are they are what you call that man they are the allies let me say in today's terms man okay the allies of america let's go back to that again says that all the men of their confederacy so the allies the men that america is in agreement with okay like the like i read earlier on here uh, with germany have been uh, one of america's uh closest strategic ally the u.s so like uh, let me highlight that it says the u the u.s germany's closest strategic ally okay germany is part of that now okay after world war one they came into agreement okay after world war ii salaki uh where's that again it says all the men of the confederacy have brought thee even to the border the men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee and prevailed against thee they that they that eat thy bread have laid a wound under thee there is none understanding with uh none understanding in uh in him and so all your the allies the the nations that you trade with the ones that, that buy from you and the ones you buy from all these nations now they're coming up against you now okay it says uh, shall i not in that day save yahweh even destroy the wise men out of edom and understanding after out of the mount of Esau. so uh, the heavenly father man is coming up, up against you man and destroying and and uh destroying all uh all these uh all these different uh all these different treaties that you guys are making man okay all these different agreements of peace okay the heavenly father is is, is turning you back when okay he's turning against he's turning like uh uh is uh is uh is breaking them apart okay because eu eu nato eu and america are gonna against are gonna go against each other man and then this is this is this shows you they are uh, the this shows you that in their minds the, these different nations man uh th this shows you that this thing is already in their mind okay all these different nations man all these different european nations okay to to create themselves a separate nation a separate army from america okay now russia is no longer the big bad wolf america is now being listed as as a, as a feared nation okay so Amer russia is gonna match on america europe is gonna match on america okay okay anyway uh yeah man so just these are a few articles that are, after i saw this man i remember these two articles in order to uh to include them in this lesson and uh i hope that was edifying and until next time i'll say shalom